up, everybody? This is Adi, Gary. Uh, this is pickups number five. Now, Gary has probably the best buy I've ever seen off of eBay. Um, and he has a shit ton of games. So I'm just going to go first, get right out of the way, because mine's going to take like two seconds. Um, <laughs> there was a special on GameStop um, up until the 29th of February where you buy two games, get one free. So I did that. Um, I bought... Let's see, which ones did I buy, actually? I think I bought Luigi's Mansion, and I bought Mario Sunshine, and got Sonic Adventure 2 Battle for free. But I only got these two in the cases. They, you know, actually had the real cases with the real box art. And then this one, Luigi's Mansion, was in, like, the crappy GameStop cases. Didn't come with you know anything and the game did not work so contacted them told them what was going on and they sent me a new one and it was actually the GameCube box with the cover and the manual and the disc works so yeah if you just contact them maybe they'll you know help you out you know GameStop has a bad reputation of crap like that but you know contact them they'll help you out and uh, also I got these are just Blank cases, GameCube cases, they're official ones if you open it on the inside. It actually has the GameCube logo. And I put my uh, Twilight Princess in there. That shows you on my other pickups video, but you can see it says GameCube. It's got the sleeve. So all I gotta do is just print off the cover and I'm good to go. So those are my three or four pickups. And um, now I'm gonna go take a nap or uh, go get married or, you know, I, I don't know, go watch some porn or something. Uh, while he, he goes through all this because it's going to take a while, so yeah, I'll, I'll be back. <laughs> Alright, what's up everybody? I won this pretty cool uh, auction on eBay, so I got 20 games all together, but I also got some more stuff which I'll be showing you. First I got Jungle Strike, which is a sequel to Desert Strike, it's complete in the box. Got. Sonic 3, complete in the box. So we got Altered Beast, complete in the box. Cyborg Justice, which don't really care about that one because I've heard it kind of sucks, but it's complete in the box. Got Out of This World. Which I used to play this on PC. It's not not a bad game. The graphics are kind of kind of weak. I don't know if you can see them or not, but they were pretty good for back in the day. They were different. Got King's Bounty, which I've never seen this out in the wild. I mean, I saw it at one place, but they wanted quite a bit of money for it. And you know, this was just included with this whole set. Sonic Spinball, which I've never played that, but it's like Sonic the Hedgehog, a pin, like a pinball game. Arch Rivals, never played that. Didn't really care about that one. <laughs> Alright, now we get to all the loose, loose cards, which got the first John Madden Football, which I used to play this. Pretty fun game. Wow, this robot looks great. <laughs> Sorry. Krusty Super Fun House, which I've never played that, so I have no idea. Is it Simpsons? Yeah. <laughs> got the Genesis six pack, which I already have, but you know, it's got awesome games on it. Like Sonic the Hedgehog, Golden Axe, Streets of Rage, Revenge of Shinobi, which that is like my favorite Sega Genesis game. Columns and Super Hang On. All in one cartridge. Sonic the Hedgehog 2 without the not for a resale label on it. Sonic the Hedgehog with the res not for resale label on it. Alright. Not for resale. Not for resale. Kid Chameleon, which I played it before, it's, it's pretty fun. 
pretty creative. You put on like all these different suits and gives you like different abilities. Now, this game, I was super excited to see this in there. This is Strider. And this is like an awesome game. I used to play this back in the arcade and loved that game. So, Street Fighter 2, the Special Champion Edition, which loves some Street, Street Fighter. NBA Jam Tournament Edition. Like it, NBA Jam a lot. Miss Pac Man. I, I really like Miss Pac Man. I've never played it on the Genesis, but. You would, you put <laughs> I have no clue about this game. It's called Toxic Crusaders. Guy yeah, looks like the uh, Toxic Avenger if you've ever seen that movie, so I'm pretty sure that's what they based it off of. Kind of strange because that movie was like rated R. <laughs> and like Whatever. one of those uh, trauma films, I guess is what you call them. Alright, I used to have this game. This game's pretty awesome. This is Rambo 3. It's kind of like uh, Akari Warriors. But I think it's better than Akari Warriors. Also got, I'm not going to unwrap them, but this aftermarket controller with like slow motion controls and turbo controls, I don't really care about that. It's an aftermarket controller. Yeah. Whatever. Got the official Sega six button controller, which makes two of these I have now. For some reason I have, I have a hard time finding these when I'm going somewhere to buy. They always have the knockoff aftermarket generic ones. And I was really happy to see that I got this, which is the Sega six button arcade stick. Now this thing is nice. I looked it up on eBay just alone and it, it's going for like 30 bucks. But yeah, I really like this thing. It's pretty big, pretty Pretty well made. Feels just like arcade controls. And the very last part of this auction was the creme de la creme, the Model One Sega Genesis. Now, there's something different about this Genesis. I don't know if you can see. But let me get closer to the camera. Right here, if you can see that. This Genesis has been modded for S-Video, which I've tested out, and it works great. Like, it looks way better than standard uh, composite or the crappy RF connection. But another thing about this model Genesis is this was one of the uh, Genesis, the first run of Genesis that were made that doesn't have the anti-piracy lockout chip. So like, when you start up a game, you don't have to, uh, it doesn't have the uh, produced and or licensed by Sega before the game starts up. It just starts up with the Sega logo and the game starts. No more so, yeah, waiting time. I was really pleased about that, and this thing's like in really good shape. Yeah, it is. Like, it looks brand new almost. High definition graphics. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's, that's everything I got. How much was all this? It was with shipping, with shipping, all together was like $76, which <laughs> yeah. the S video mod alone costs, I looked at it, people are charging like $60 and up just to do an S video mod on your Genesis, <laughs> which I mean, I know how to do anyway, but it was just convenient that I found this auction with all these games and stuff with it already done. You guys have a better deal than that, <laughs> you let us know, because... That's amazing, in my opinion. For my stuff, I got uh, you know, I got these three, the GameCube games, for like thirty-four, I think. After everything, shipping and all that, and then with these, they were like three ninety-eight. And after shipping, it was probably like I don't know seven. But his is way better, so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was pretty pleased with it. Won the, I also, yeah, I won the auction with like, I won it by like 50 cents, I think, with like 
five seconds to spare. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Yeah. Alright, well, that was our fifth pickup video. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, his whole box took forever. I was able to eat a bowl of cereal and, uh, I don't know, do some other stuff. But <laughs> hope you enjoyed it. This is Adi and Gary from GameStorm, and we'll see you next time. See you later.